Hi guys, welcome to another video and in this one I'm going to be showing you guys how to acquire the minigun for free. First thing you need to do is come to the um, army base and it's easy to do, I think everyone knows how to do it by now. But it's the left road, left country road that leads, go, that leads to Blaine County. Um, I did find it easier doing this with a taxi and the reason why is just before you go uh, crash through the barrier, press L3 or your left stick and it will activate the taxi mission and it kind of gives you no wanted level for the first five or so seconds but it really does help uh, and it allows you to get in there without getting too much trouble as you'll see now I managed to breach that, turn the corner and I only get wanted level once I get quite deep inside about there, there you go so you want to take him out because he's going to give you hassle unless you do and equip your gun straight away because you might find resistance. The first time I've done it I found a couple of people in here, second time I only found him and a couple way upstairs. So it looks like you can go through that door but you actually can't. What you have to do is go through the metal detector. Um, you can explore everything but I'll do it afterwards. Go up the stairs. They are quite long. There's six floors of them. So you want to go to the sixth one. Uh, on my playthrough there was a guy at the top waiting for me and he, ne he nearly got me which was quite scary because I got right to the top. So, on the sixth floor, this first store is the one you want to go in. Around the corner, you can explore again and go right up to the, well, the control tower. And there it is. And once you get it, you've got it for life. All you then have to do is pay for the ammo, which is a hell of a lot cheaper than the gun. There you go, and it comes with a thousand rounds. And this thing is a fire-breathing demon. There's, there's no denying that. I was just exploring at this time to see if there's anything else in here. Um, from what I can see, there wasn't apart from the med kit at the top, and that was really about it. Uh, for me, I needed that med kit. I mean, you're probably going to die when you get out of there, but that's not the point. The point is to acquire this so that it's within your inventory, even after you die. So, obviously I don't make it out of this place alive. Do the funky chicken! That's what I like to see. But you know, I go out on my terms, not theirs. So I go out like a pro. Bitch, you can never take me alive. Shush, fan. Shush. No, shush now. So you'll see I've died. I respawned at the hospital in Blaine County and uh, it's, it's available for me in the gun shop now. And the only thing you have to pay for is the ammo. There's no customizable options apart from the paints, but I don't I, if I want to do that, I'll pay for the duty. It's a hell of a lot cheaper than buying it, because I don't even remember how much it is without acquiring it like that. But I hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Uh, give us a subscribe because we're going to have many more GTA 5 video content coming out as well as uh, Battlefield 4 Beta or Beta, wherever you're from. So, hope you enjoyed guys. Take care. Bye.